Out of all the questions I get from students and clients, none of them elicit the most panic than the question, help, I lost my ribbon and I don't know where it went. In today's episode, we'll talk about common ways you could lose your ribbon and the easy ways to get them back. I'm David Atkins, and welcome to ATC CAD. The most common reason that people call about this is they don't know about this little white button at the top. At the top of the ribbon, just to the far right, is this little white button that allows you to minimize the panel buttons. This is allegedly a useful tool. I don't exactly know how it is. But you click it once and it collapses them into panels. You click it again, it collapses them into words. And you click them once more and it looks like they all go away. You can still click on these tabs and they show up, but... The trick to this one, just click the white button one more time, and it comes back. Easy enough. What really scares people is when none of this is there. You accidentally close the ribbon yourself. And there's a couple ways to do it. The most common way is to right-click on some blank area and accidentally hit close. It happens. You just type the word ribbon. And, you know, if you spell it right, it opens up the ribbon and puts it right back where it is. Another way that people sometimes make this mistake is they right-click on it and they undock it. In this case, the ribbon acts like it's a palette, and you can actually dock it on the bottom or the right or the left or whatever the heck you'd like to put it. And, of course, like any palette, you can close it. Again, just type ribbon and then drag it back up to the top of the page. When you get that gray outline, you can let go and it'll redock to its original position. Hopefully knowing these two tricks will keep you from panicking the next time someone comes to you and says, oh my God, I just broke AutoCAD. It's pretty easy to fix so long as you know how to do it. If this helps you out, click the like button. If you'd like to see more tips like this, definitely hit subscribe and if you've got some other random questions that you've come up with, leave them in the comments. I'd love to take a look at it. And of course, if you're interested in our AutoCAD, Revit, Inventor, Fusion 360, MicroStation, Civil 3D, SketchUp, or 3DS Max classes, check us out at AtkinsTechConsulting.com. As always, I'm David, and happy catting.